Today I'm reviewing something unique and exclusive coming to us from the United Arab Emirates. A true hub of technology and innovation. What makes Falcon H1 special is that this LLM is a game changer in the world of open source AI. Built by the Technology Innovation Institute, Falcon H1 LLM delivers top tier performance, rivaling models like GPT-4 and Google's Palm 2, while being far more efficient and completely free to use. What makes it special? It's fast, lightweight, and trained on a massive, high-quality data set. Plus, it's designed to run on everything from supercomputers to laptops. Whether you're a researcher, developer, or just curious, Falcon gives you serious power without locking you into a walled garden. Let's put this brand new innovative large language model to the test and perhaps compare it to another model. Let's try to discover the unique abilities of Falcon H1 LLM. I'm excited and I hope you're just as excited. Let's jump straight into it. Let's dive deep. I'm going to click on try our chat. Immediately I'm taken to the sign up page. I'm now logged in and it's time to type in my first prompt. I'm going to ask Falcon itself what's so special about it. What is so unique about Falcon LLM? I see the output and here is how I understand it. Outside of major facts such as Falcon H1 being open source and highly efficient, which means the model is publicly available and optimized for computational resources, Falcon is trained on its own unique data sets that include multiple language and various linguistic peculiarities. Falcon LLM also has its own moral compass, if you will, developed in the Arab world for the Arab world and beyond. It has a stronger focus on Arabic language, culture, understanding and processing. This puts Falcon H1 in competition with models like GPT and DeepSeek. Oh yeah, if you care about technology being used ethically, Falcon is also a great option. It's designed to mitigate biases and ensure fairness. Falcon is developed and continuously improved by the Technology Innovation Institute. Let's begin testing this LLM. First test. Let's call it the efficiency test. I'm going to ask Falcon to explain how transformers work in simple language with three analogies and a four bullet point summary. Here's my prompt. Explain how transformers work in simple language. Add three analogies and a four bullet point summary. Send. And now I'm going to ask ChatGPT the same question. Send. It took Falcon a couple of seconds to respond and ChatGPT was a bit slower, around 5 to 6 seconds. When comparing the two responses, Falcon's version feels more structured and technically insightful. While ChatGPT's response is friendly and beginner focused, Falcon's version balances clarity with substance, introducing foundational concepts like parallel processing and the attention mechanism in a way that's both digestible and informative. Its analogies are thoughtful and well-organized, reinforcing the idea of understanding entire sequences at once, which is central to how transformers work. Falcon goes a step further by noting the model's versatility beyond just text, showing a broader grasp of real-world applications. For anyone looking for a clear yet professional explanation, Falcon's response delivers more depth without overwhelming the reader, making it the stronger of the two. So ChatGPT is great for a friendly tone and simple responses, whereas Falcon LLM provides a more technical, well-grounded explanation. Let's now conduct a chain of thought reasoning test. Let's highlight Falcon's ability to think step by step, showing instruction following and logical coherence. Here's my prompt. Send. So this response from Falcon demonstrates clear and structured chain of thought, reasoning of a basic level. Let's level it up. This is my prompt. 
sand. Okay, Falcon nailed this business case with a clear structured breakdown of profits, smart use of variables, and solid business logic. Instead of guessing numbers, it walked through each step symbolically, showing exactly how to evaluate the campaign's impact. The response was thoughtful, realistic, and professional, highlighting trade-offs without overreaching. It reads like something you'd hear in a consulting presentation, making Falcon look sharp, capable, and business savvy. Let's move on to the next test, instruction following and task chaining. Let's see how well Falcon can understand multi-part prompts, execute tasks in the correct order, and maintain internal consistency between steps. Here's my prompt. I want Falcon to summarize this article in two lines. Falcon handles this multi-step task impressively well. It summarized the paragraph clearly, asked a smart follow-up question that naturally extended the topic and gave a well-reasoned answer. The tone was clean and professional and the logic flowed smoothly from start to finish. While the answer could have been a bit shorter to better match the brief instruction, it still nailed the core idea and showed solid understanding of the content. Overall, it's a great example of Falcon following complex instructions and responding with clarity. I'm also impressed by how fast each response was. Speed is definitely one of Falcon's strengths. So it's called Falcon for a reason. To highlight Falcon's strength in Arabic, especially over ChatGPT or other Western trained models, I want to ask nuanced questions involving Arabic language, dialects and cultural idioms. Areas where Falcon trained with a Middle Eastern focus often outperforms. Let me first ask Falcon what it knows better about Arabic language and culture, including linguistic nuances, than the Western trained models. What do you understand better about the Arabic culture, dialects, and cultural idioms compared to Western trained models? Sent. You can see the reply on the screen, but let me be more specific. What question should I ask ChatGPT that it's likely to answer incorrectly or inadequately when it comes to Arab culture? Look, Falcon is helping me out here. Let's copy this question and ask both LLMs to respond to it. Let's start with Falcon LLM, sent. Now ChatGPT, sent. You can clearly see the Falcon's explanation of the arabesque stands out for its cultural authenticity and spiritual depth, offering insights that feel rooted in the Arab Islamic worldview rather than merely academic. By referencing concepts like Tawhid and uh, highlighting the functional, symbolic and identity forming roles of the arabesque, Falcon delivers a perspective that's both informed and intimate. In contrast, while while ChatGPT is well structured and historically rich, its view feels more external and descriptive. For topics grounded in Arab culture, Falcon provides a more resonant and meaningful response, I would say. This is what I've discovered about Falcon H1 LLM. This model stands out for its cultural fluency, especially in Arabic language and heritage. It's efficient architecture that delivers high performance with lower resource demands and its commitment to open source accessibility, which is so important in today's world. Unlike many Western trained models, Falcon LLM blends deep regional insight with global capability, making it both technically strong and culturally aware. It's not just an AI model, it's a reflection of localized intelligence with universal reach. I'll continue keeping an eye on Falcon and perhaps in my upcoming videos, I'll be able to highlight something new about this unique LLM, but I'm done for now. I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, leave your comments in the comment section. I'll talk to you soon. Ivan KV. Out.